boys and girls. Today we're going to be talking about lots of dots. Are you ready to get started? So here are some ladybugs. And what do you notice about these ladybugs? That's right, they have different dots on them. So here's one that has zero dots here, and this one has one. Can you count this one? One, two dots. And this ladybug has one, two, three dots. And this ladybug has one, two, three, four dots. And five, six, seven, and this one over here has eight. So we're going to play a little game with some dots. Okay, I'm going to get my pen here. And I want to make the number three. I'm going to write the number three. So I want to find different ways to make three. Okay, so I know if I have one dot and another dot and another dot that I have three right and let's write an equation for that one so one plus one plus one equals three okay let's find another one let's see what if i had two dots And I added one more. Would that give me three dots? That's right, it would. So let me write that equation. One plus two equals three. Could I have also said two plus one equals three. Yes, it doesn't matter if I added the two or the one first. They both gave me three. Okay, so I'm going to move these up so I have some room. So I found that combination. Okay, so how else can I make three? Let's see. I have three here. So if I have three and how many dots are on here? That's right. There's zero dots on that one. So let's see if I have three plus zero that still equals three total dots doesn't it so i found other ways could i use any of these not adding them could i so four five six seven and eight that would have been too many Okay, let's do another one. Okay, this time we are going to try to find combinations to make four. Okay, let's see. Could we do four and what we need with that? That's right, zero. So this right here would be a combination 
for 4. Let's write that as an equation. 4 plus 0 equals 4. Okay. Do you think we can find another one? Three, and what would I need to add to three to make four? That's right, one. So let's write that as an equation. This is pretty fun, isn't it? Three and one equal four. Great job, so this makes four. And this makes four. Okay, can we make another one? Let's see. I have two. What else can I add to two to make four? That's right. That's like a double, isn't it? Get my pen back. So two plus two equals four. Okay, very good. Could we also have one and two and one does that make four what do you think let's add them up two three four yes that makes four so let's write that equation one plus two plus one equals four. Very good. Okay, are you ready to do some more? So now let's do um, seven. Are you ready to do seven? Let's find combinations for seven. Ooh, I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and get seven here. I'm going to count and make sure, be really precise here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, that says seven, right? Seven dots. Seven, hmm, what can I add to it to still have seven? That's right, zero. So if I have seven and I don't add any more to it, I still have seven. Very good. Let's find another one. What if I have six? What can I add to it? That's right, I could add one to it. And I would have seven. Are you sure? That's right, six. And if I count one more, I have seven. Very good. Okay, let's see. What if I have five? Hmm, I could add one more to it. Five, six, how many more do I need? One more. Is that seven? Yes, it is. So if I have five plus one plus one more, that is seven. Well, that's kind of making me think of something else. Let's see. If I have five, 
what if I added two more? Is that seven? Five, six, seven. Yes, it is. So five plus two is seven. Let's add that. This is fun finding all the combinations of seven, isn't it? Okay, let's see. Hmm. What if I picked this one? How many dots does that have? That's right, it has four. Four. How many more do I need to make seven? That's right, three. Four, five, six, seven. So if I want to write that as an equation, what am I going to write? Four plus three equals seven. That is correct. There are more combinations, aren't there, boys and girls, especially using more than one number. That is a great job, and you're going to get to practice making different combinations with the ladybugs. Great job.